Look, I'm trying to explain to you, I did not come from privilege. I did not born with a silver spoon in my mouth. I'm trying to explain to you, I'm not standing here because of an accident. I saw this a long time ago. I spoke it into my life. See, the thing about it is there are a few people that say, look, I'm going to make a decision to shine or just wait in the moment come to shine. Who are you? Look, you all have greatness within you. Nobody else can tell you that you have it or you don't. Love saved me. It was that moment of broken heart that she told me. I said to myself, there must be something wrong with the world. I understood that in that moment that some people don't know what love is. That same room with people that are passionate about life. I'm in a room with people that want to win. I'm in a room not just with entrepreneurs. I'm in a room with people that want to leave a legacy behind so that when they're gone, people's lives are still changing because of their story. I'm a game changer. I'm a life changer. If you speak to me, I want to get you to the next level. All we got is 24 hours. If you woke up this morning, you only got this second with me to make a decision. If I'm going to say, look, I'm going to stop smoking. I'm going to go to the gym. I'm going to get fit. I'm going to pursue my dream. I want you to get this mindset that you understand things don't happen by accident. They happen by purpose. I'm going to, I'm going to speak life into people's lives. I'm going to teach them how to love. I'm going to let them understand that once you start valuing yourself, I was watching a video with Oprah Winfrey yesterday and Oprah said when the guy on the, on the Daily Show he asked her look tell me something normal about your life and Oprah said uh, uh, look I like avocados I travel with avocados I don't know if you watched it and he, he said uh, but then I bought a whole orchid <laughs> I, said, I said tell me something normal about your life look there's nothing normal about you when you start pursuing your dream, when you're living for greatness. I'm trying to explain to you, these words I'm wearing, push past the pain. It didn't come by accident. In my depression, in my broken heart, I was laying on my bed, about to oh, take my life. I understood. If I didn't wake up and say, I'm going to value me, I'm going to love me. I'm going I'm to get to a place that the dark world don't define me. So yeah, personal development is no joke. So that's why they make prices. In this room, there are special people with special purpose. In this room, uh, if I could just get you to believe this, that's all I want. I, uh, right now, I came to inspire you that if you win or lose, that this day, when you walk out of this room, you will never be the same. I explain to you that when you get to the mindset, that you value yourself and you love yourself and you understand there's nobody in this world like you. There's nobody that can do what you can do. You will get to that place that no matter, no matter how hard it gets, no matter how difficult it gets, you are willing to take the journey. I need you to just say, I'm going to take the journey. Say, I'm going to take the journey. Don't get off. Don't get off. Don't you dare quit on me. You've come too far. You've been through too much, too much pain, too much hurt. You've been let down. They tried, they tried you. Oh man, look, my father looked me in the eye and said, son, I'm proud of you. That was victory. Couldn't even type, couldn't even spell, but I'm a published author of three books. I'm trying to explain to you. I'm not trying to glorify myself. I've been through pain. So yeah, to be a get capable somebody else. If you could just pull somebody else up, if you could push somebody else forward, I'll, if you could if you'd be willing to see somebody else the same way you see yourself, I want you to know that God will bless you. I, I'm sorry, I, I'm a little bit of a believer. I, I don't know about you, but I, I'm a little bit of a believer. I said, I am royal. I am peculiar. I'm different. I, st I, I wasn't cut from the same cloth like you. I didn't come from Bulgaria. I came from Montserrat in the Caribbean island where a volcano took everything. I don't have a baby photo. So I did not come here by accident. It came by purpose. If you could just believe that this is your year. If you could just believe two boys in a boat. Oh, it's not good. start coming in. They're going to die. Because they can't swim. What are they doing in the boat? They can't swim. 
and say, look, if you go out, you will sink a bit lower, slowly. And that's waiting about. So I look, I'll go out first. I say, look, I don't know what I'm going to do. I can't leave you in the boat. Please, I say, let's go out first. I'm going to jump. And then he's paddling. He's about to die. I say, look, I don't know. And the other one screams, so look, we're both going to die. I'm going to jump over too. He jumped with him and said, look, you got to make a decision. You either swim or die. It's that simple. And I'm telling you today, your dream is the same. You either swim or die. It's your decision. Go after your dream and I guarantee you, you will become successful. It's your boy, Dr. G, the love motivator. I love you guys. Thank you for your time.